So today, hopefully, uh, most of you are following the WHO recommendations and the government directives and are staying at home and working from home. So while working from home, uh, it is important to stay motivated, to stay healthy, not just in the mind, but also in, in the body. And I thought that I would share some of the tips for you that I'm practicing that are helping me. So first thing to remember is uh, while maintaining social distancing, we also want social communication and social connection with other people. Um, also, uh, it's important to remember that it's not just about the mind, it's about the body. Physical exercise is very good for you. It's good to keep your immune system strong and it's good to get some physical exercise in so that you feel tired and that you sleep better. That way you're able to perform and operate better on a daily basis. Uh, and one final tip that um, uh, I recommend to all is that um, establish a discipline when you're at home. When we're at home, we're used to relaxing. So you have to break that habit. You have to introduce discipline, a certain number of hours when you work and when you're very focused, but also allow time to relax to wind down and defocus. You can't be working all the time. Uh, you have to be able to manage your stress levels. The way you manage your stress levels, in part, is by controlling the information you take in. In the same way as you eat healthy foods and you don't want to eat food that's bad for you, same goes with information and mental food. You want to be eating healthy mental food and keeping the rubbish away from your mind. There's a lot of rumors out there, there's a lot of nonsense, and there is a lot of panic. Don't pay attention to that. Focus on reliable sources only. Otherwise, you will burn out too quickly. So here are some tips that I'd like to share for you that work for me, and uh, I, I wish you all the best. There's a number of sources that you can go and check online from WHO, some social, psychosocial support hotlines and websites. There's plenty of, of stuff out there on YouTube and social media. So I think that uh, if you stay focused and follow these uh, guidelines and recommendations, you will get through this difficult period just fine.